Hello, this is Geo. Hey, look what we have here. We have an Epson EcoTank printer. And we're gonna show you a few tips about how to fill the ink tank today. So as you can see through the display windows, these tanks are actually already full because I just filled them up. And I filled them up with these little bottles of ink. And this is the benefit of the eco tank. And sometimes uh, different printers call these different things, sometimes super tanks, etc. But basically, instead of using cartridges, like you see here, this is uh, cartridges for a cannon. These are the yellow uh, colors. Instead of inserting these and when they're empty you basically take these out and throw them away. In this case you just refill the tank and it's much more economical buying these large bottles of ink rather than the individual cartridges. And so today I'll show you how I filled this how I filled up this printer with this ink for the first time. So when it's time to refill your ink, the first thing you want to do is lift up the top of the unit to expose the interior. And the way you do that is uh, by grabbing onto the little handle here on the right side and the other handle here from the left. Now this is different from opening up the top scanning plate right here. Uh, this will actually, uh, by grabbing these handles here, you'll actually lift up the whole top of the unit. And I'll show you that right here. So you can see, and then there'll be a little bit of resistance. Try and do this with one hand. And you'll hear a little click and the top of the tray should just stay just like that. Now to lower it, you'll need to apply a little extra pressure down, but then it'll just kind of land just down like that. So uh, you will feel a little bit of resistance going up just like that. And then you just need to lift up this little lid to expose the tanks here. Okay, as I said before, it comes with uh, four different little bottles of ink, the black, the blue, the yellow, and the magenta. Now, well, one thing I do like about this uh, printer is that it gives you the three different colors, not just a single cartridge. This will save you money. A lot of other printers do come with three different cartridges, but again, this is an eco tank, and so this is a refillable tank, which should save you a lot of money um, moving forward. Okay, so we're just removing the cap, and it's just a typical twist. You'll notice that there's a central portion where the ink goes out, and you'll see these two little arms, so just make note of that. Put that down right now. Then you wanna, uh, where it says eco tank you just want to lift that up and this will expose where you actually refill the ink and to uh, start with the black which is on the left you just lift this up just like that you may also notice here in the black there's the little uh, kind of like nozzle where the ink's going to be injected in but there's also kind of a slot on this side and that side and that kind of corresponds to what you're seeing on the top of the ink so you're not going to put it in this way you're going to put it in the direction where these slots are now we're not going to kind of squeeze this we're just going to use let gravity uh, take its course and after about you know like a minute or so you'll just see it, it's filling up and it'll fill up and stop automatically um, there might be some additional ink in here uh, that will be extra uh, and so just make note of that when you're done and so you want to just uh, tip it over like that kind of insert it and kind of press down and you'll hear the ink coming out and you'll also see the black ink slowly fill. And then you'll eventually hear it stop filling. Just wait a few seconds. And then carefully kind of pull it out. It shouldn't drip, but uh, just, you know, don't, don't hit it. And there you go. I think mostly filled. There might be a little bit left over. I think I'll save that and uh, maybe use it at, in a future date if, if there is some residual ink in there. And then you just want to take this lever and secure it down again. And then we want to do, uh, well, the blue or the cyan 
the magenta, and then the yellow, making note of the colors. You don't want to put, let's say, the yellow in the cyan or the blue. So uh, we'll just continue with the cyan first. Undo that. Do the same process. Kind of hit, put it in there. And you can start seeing the blue or the cyan filling up. Okay, just a note, uh, you do not have to wait for these tanks to be empty before you refill them. If they're only half empty and you have a bottle with ink in it, you can top it off to the top at any time. Uh, there is a warning, however. Now with these tanks, uh, you, you have to be aware that these are not cartridges. So if you accidentally pour in, let's say we're in magenta right now, if you accidentally pour in, let's say yellow, ink into the magenta, well, it's going to be really hard to get that ink out of there. Uh, you'll have to check with the manufacturer to see if there's a way to do that. Now with the cartridges, uh, if you made a mistake like that, you could always remove the cartridge and kind of start from scratch. But in this case, you're filling up an entire tank and that might be hard to reverse. So just be aware, don't make a mistake. Always double check if it's yellow, Make sure that what you're putting in there is also yellow. And there you go. That is how you refill an Epson EcoTank printer. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please hit that like button at the bottom of the screen and even consider subscribing to my channel. I have many more videos to come. Bye-bye.